behind the iconic London cab and the big bus, the hop on, hop off tour bus, are two interesting buildings. The one at the back is New Zealand House, so that's the High Commission of New Zealand. Not the most beautiful building in the world, but the building in front of it is Her Majesty's Theatre. There has been a theatre there since the 1700s, but this front is from 1897. Her Majesty's is very famous because it shows Phantom of the Opera, the second longest running musical in the West End. Opened here in 1986 and it hasn't moved. Beautiful frontage, slightly <laughs> ruined by New Zealand House behind. Her Majesty's quite famously always changes with the monarch. So obviously since 1952, it's been known as Her Majesty's, but the plan is now, and I'm filming this in April, 2023. Next month, we have the coronation of King Charles. So the chances are that this will change and be known as His Majesty's. Trouble is in London, there are quite a few theatres named after men. It would be quite nice to keep it as Her Majesty's. And there's the royal seal there. So this is effectively a theatre royal. So it has royal boxes. The only theatre in the West End with two royal boxes is the Theatre Royal Drury Lane. Theatre Royal Drury Lane in the 1800s was home to a fight between George III and his son, the Prince Regent, who later became George IV. So the management separated them and gave them a box each. Here is the Theatre Royal Haymarket. You have the Theatre Royal Lincoln's Inn, the Theatre Royal Drury Lane, and the third Theatre Royal in 1821 was the Haymarket. Has no dressing room 13, considered course by many worldwide to be an unlucky number. We're filming this on a Sunday so there's no show today but ending at the end of April 2023 is a musical which was on here pre-Covid restrictions and then there was a gap for about a year and a half and then it reopened. Only Fools and Horses the musical. It's a lovely Regency look. Theatre Royal Haymarket in 1821 was built really for King George IV, who was the Prince Regent, which is why at the top of the road you also have a Regent Street. So we're in the heart of the West End now. Do join me again. Do subscribe to my channel. I'll be booking some live streams in the near future. And also you can get in touch about in-person tours. Lovely to spend time with you and thanks for all your support. Lots of love. <laughs>